Welcome everyone to another Train Sim 2018 video. Today we'll be driving something quite interesting actually. This is I'm doing, this I'm doing um, having help with future simulations. Um, ain't released yet. It's announced on my website. If you haven't seen it on my website, on the coming soon tab. So if you do know, you know what it is. This is you, you, you can tell what this is by the, the title and the thumbnail of this video. But you probably can. Do, this is just a quick drive scenario. So yeah, we're just gonna just sit and board the Sheen S and C. And yeah. So <laughs> excuse me for sniffing. I have got a bit cold. And. The game is frozen at the moment, I just pulled, well not frozen, it's paused, but let's turn around. If you haven't, if you're not on my web, Facebook pay, Facebook group, you wouldn't know, you won't know about this, but if you are on my Facebook group, you will, would know about this. But I've only just completed this delivery today, and before anyone asks, I ended doing the yellow version. So, here we have the Class 508, ladies and gentlemen. I'll show you the bits in the way. Um, so this destinations are not done. Still, still quite a bit to do. I'm going to change where it says 313 because that's actually parked texture. The next three digit is actually like the child object. That I don't, I'm not sure if I should do. Um, the D, where it's a max speed DC, I'm going to get rid of that. Obviously, because, well, uh, well, actually, we, yeah, we have to keep DC, because we are DC, you idiot. But change it to 75 miles per hour and get rid of the AC, because obviously this is a 508. Um, well, Technically, I took. But I'll tell you on our journey. So, we will have a guard because obviously this line does have a guard. The destinations aren't done yet. But the majority of this, the hardest part is actually the reskin in itself, it's actually complete. Um, got a little thing up here to do, sort that out, but apart from that, uh, we're gonna go. Let's regard. go so so as you might be aware if you're on my Facebook group you'll be seeing that I've been doing the 508 and as we all know we got the 315 in the game as you all know the 508 are DC only and there was a reskin of a 508 and a 507 on a website ages ago, but it's been taken down. Um, but if you did see that, or use it, or downloaded it, you would see the trailer is actually the, just a panther, but it, it's a full 313 set. So. Mm. So, what I've done is I've taken the 313 tra 315 trailer car and actually ignore the doors, that's a bug. I don't know how to fix it. But this is actually the 315 trailer car and the game actually still thinks it's the 313 pantograph coach. I've, I've figured out a way of how to do it. 
but it the game thinks it's the Panther Punch. But But yeah. The cowboys just stay the same. So interested to see as they say that like special that was in junction so the destinations aren't done yet. There is AI like two AI trains, they don't move, they're just static, but this is only point drive. I'm thinking maybe the scenario actually for this branch. Not sure yet. The first stop is Queensborough. So the five arrays was actually in this library and then they got replaced by the four six six and which are two cars. So but they got an advantage with four six six well that's enough. So yeah. Before you ask yourself reason is actually not a child object. No. It's actually painted on, but you can't really tell that really. So the game actually just still thinks that's the 313, 313 pantograph coach, which it's not. It's actually the 315, as you can see, look, it's no pantograph coach, it's no pantograph, no dip in it, it's the proper 315 trader, so it acts out as it's a 508. Very Kensley. So to see, there's just a static AI there. It makes it a bit lost like to be fair, to have a train there, because they do pass each other at Kenzie's passing point. So I just went into a match, you see. So yeah, ignore the doors on the trailer coach, that's just a bug, I don't know how to fix it. If you do know how to fix it, let me know, and then, yeah. So there's two things to do now, but well, I still go to the yellow version, like yellow doors. But the only thing that needs to be done now is the numbering when you load the preload. So this I've done it in the world editor. But that's just got that to do and the preload, so a free and a six copy. So what I'll be discussing is what will be in this pack. So what will be in the pack is the class 508 dash 3 and that the dash 3s 508 are 301, 302 and 303 and they operated on Silverlink and the Watford DC line that worked with the 313s. Silverlink only had three 508s and they, when London Overground took it, they kept them. So they had London Overground, Logan, and, and then it got, eventually it got placed by the 378, and they went side right, so on, silver way, slash London Overground went for scrap. And um, all the 508s in South Eastern went for scrap, and 
the only place you see fly right now is on the Mersey Rail Network along with 507 if you're wondering what the difference with uh, 547 and 508 are uh, now are just different compressors that's the only difference but 507's they was originally four cars um, to work on the southwestern route in the suburbans, but then they later got converted to three cars to work on the Mersey Road and the extra trailer car went onto the four, five, four, six, four, five, five, dash, five, okay, I remember. So we've got slow down. There we go. One swile. So it looks really nice now. There is a couple issues. Well, the only issue I've got is these doors, which I don't know how to sort it out. But if someone knows, let me know. And if you want to sort it out, I'll, well, I'm sending it to Future Simulations. Well, he, he's got it, so he can. Um, he's only got the Silverlink version. Because, yeah. But I'll. He will. He can easily. He can see if he. Can. I'm actually pleased how well I've done. Just went for the guard. I kept this network southeast seats because I didn't know what mocap they actually have. And now we're going over the the bridge, and there uh, you see there's quite a big section on the bridge that hasn't got flowed well, so we can't take power. So, obviously it lifts us up. So it's let boats through. Obviously we don't need to take power. Next up is Queensborough and then Sheerness. So yeah, sorry this ain't a long video, but I'll uh, so this is just a showcase that and if you're wondering about the 357, that is still on hold at the moment. I've been going on this line tomorrow anyway, so <laughs> So now we can just floor it to set the fire. Lovely. And off we go. So yeah, the things I've got to do in the cab, I'll, I'll tell you how things work. The game would let you still drive it with overheads, 
but obviously, like I said at the beginning of the video, the game still thinks there's a 313 pantograph coach. I just basically can't remember how I did it actually. I have to do a tutorial how you do that actually, how I did it. If you want me to do a tutorial how I actually swapped it, how I um, swapped it out and the game still thinks. Because if you just added the 315 coach with the 313 trailers, you wouldn't be able to move the train. So that's why I had to make the game think it's still the pantograph coach. Which is quite impressive because I, I figured that out myself. I just like, what? I just, it took me about an hour to work it out. But, got them. We got steam through it. No, the brakes and the 313. We're not going to speed through it. Mm, not bad. I passed it a little bit. It's a bit good screenshot anyway. Good screenshot. I don't know which one I'm going to use for the fun now. God. Obviously, even though this is like a shuttle service, on Monday to Saturdays you have two trains every half hour, but on the Sunday they're hourly. But even though it's like a shuttle service, they still have guards. Obviously, but it's in the guards boundary zones. So that's where they got guards. What? Why is? I'm not even gonna say anything. Look at that! I'm just impressed by it. To be fair. I don't know how to put a towel on so you can actually do this. So as of what I was going to say is where the 313 says here, that is actually part of the texture. But the next three digits, the unit number, is actually is actually like the child object. But the 313 is part of the texture, so that's going to be changed. 313 up here is going to be changed, the AC information is going to be taken off, and the way max speed DC I've got to change that to center 5. See, so, the rate could do like center 5 with DC. Uh, I still f this is one of my hardest things I've done on my own. Well, so we're approaching Stunus. That's actually typical. Um, I don't even know how I can sort this problem out. Don't know how I can sort this problem out. 
Uh, that's a typical one near the end, no. But it is a 4.66. I was going to get a good screenshot, but I don't see that happening. Let's get it. It's good. That's a good screenshot indeed. So I'm got, I've got under air because I don't even know how to get the train moving again after you've done it. Except the AWS, that's typical. Um, so thanks for watching. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share and subscribe to share this further eight unit around. To tell people it's actually going to look like a five eight, especially with the trader coach. Still, I'm concerned about the doors, but hopefully that can be fixed. Um, my Facebook group link will be in the description. Um, my, f my Instagram will be in the description. So my username, so just type that username in the Instagram so you can have a chat on there. And my website will be on in the description as well. So thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Ciao.